hi guys welcome back to my channel today we are going to see how to calculate square root of any number without using a calculator we are taking first a very simple number which is 25 and dividing it by simple division like I am doing so so I am taking whatever the numbers I have divided it with here down here 5 into 5 and I am taking both two same digits as one common so this is the trick behind calculating a square root with this division method our next number is 2025 so directly we are going to divide it by any number since it at units place 5 is there so it would go only in 5 so let us see 5 4 yeah, we are taking 0 because 2 is lesser than 5 5 into 8 equals 40 now let us take 3 3 2 equals 3 into 2 equals 6 2 is the remainder 3 7 now here our number is fully divided so what we are going to do is we are going to write these numbers down here which is 5 into 5 into 3 to 3 into now we are going to remove common numbers common digits such as this pairs we are going to write these down below and multiply them to get our square root 5 into 3 is 15 and 15 into 3 is 45 so our square root is calculated of 2025 which is 45 next we are going to calculate by log method by using log table first number which I am taking is very easy number which is 25 root of 25 how we will find that first trick is first step is you have to take this square root sign as 1 by 2 so I will write here 1 by 2 into log of whatever the number we have to find log of now what we will do we will find log of this number since it has two digits and we have to calculate characteristic so I am going to do a little rough work here since it has two digits so 2 minus 1 is equals to 1 so whatever my log would be would be after this one point you can refer my previous uh, lectures or videos about log and anti log for this I'll put a link into the description 25 the log of this number is 3979 then what I'm going to do simple division to my number is fully divided now next step would be I will calculate anti log of this number then again we have to calculate after how many decimal points or after how many digits the decimal would come so since here it has 0 so we will add 1 and so after one digit a decimal would occur please remember this now for calculation of uh, anti log of this number we will cn anti log of 69 row 69 column 8 and mean difference 9 and we will add them up so let us write it, write it down here 4989 plus 10 to remember this point after one digit the decimal would come 9 4.99 whatever you can take so it is very uh, close to 5 so our square root of 25 is calculated which is 5 it is as easy as that second example for calculating by log we will take root of 100 remember again this sign holds 1 by 2 so what we will do is 
we will write 1 by 2 into log of this number and we will find it out find the characteristic 3 digits here so 3 minus 1 equals 2 so whatever our log would come would be after 2 point we will look in column row 10 and column 0 into log which is so simple division now we will find out anti log of this number find the characteristic 1 plus 1 whatever num number in anti log would be uh, before decimal we have to take ditto this number and we have to add plus 1 so after two digits uh, our decimal would occur so let us see anti log of, anti -log of 0 0 into 0 and 0 row 0 column 0 and mean different 0 so that would be and after two digits so 1 2 and our decimal point we will write it down here exactly our uh, square root of 100 is calculated now let us take a very complex number suppose 2846 again the same steps 1 by 2 into log of this number characteristic 1 2 3 4 after 4 digits so 3 we will copy it down here we will look uh, log of 20, row 28 column 4 and mean difference 6 and we will add them up 4 5 double 3 plus simple division find anti log of this number first find how many after how many digit the decimal point will occur so one since it has one here so one plus one is equal to after two digits now you find anti log of row 72 column 7 mean difference 1 and we will add them up So after since it after two digits uh, our decimal would occur so one two so our, so our square root of this number is calculated which is pretty exact let us take a slightly a bigger number of five digit suppose four five eight nine five let us see how we can calculate again one by two into log of this number Calculate characteristic 5 digits here. So 5 minus 1 is equal to 4. Write down 1 by 2 into 4 point. Find log of row 45, column 8 and mean difference 9. So 6, 6, 1, 8. Simple division. Find anti log of this number. Characteristic after three digits, a decimal would occur. So since after three digits, so two one four point two is our square root. If you like my channel, please do comment, like, and subscribe.
Thank you.